Hello everyone, this is Mr. Wee Maniac here for part 4 of Let's Play Battle of Bikini Bottom and I need to find my controller. I j oh, there it is, okay. Anyways, my bad. Alright, anyways guys, so welcome back. We just, I went through the first area of Jellyfish Field and uh, right now what we're going to do is we're going to go into the next area called Jellyfish Caves. Um... Now this area here, Jellyfish uh, Caves, uh, I mean this area I should say, we actually got two more golden spatulas, so we now have a total of five, which is enough to go into downtown Bikini Bottom. However, the issue with that though is that I want to complete Jellyfish Field, so we're not going to actually go to downtown Bikini Bottom just yet. Wow, Mermaid Man, I have all your comets and toys and mail. <laughs> huh? What? Oh, yeah, it's that sponge kid. And now, what was I supposed to tell you? That Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Huh? Oh, no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! They're making me hit myself! Massaging your feet isn't working. I think I'd better try a more direct approach. By clipping my toenails? Here I come, Patrick! Anyways, that's a little bit weird. This is a slide. When SpongeBob, Patrick, or Sandy jump onto a slide, they will sit down the slide a slope at hydrodynamic speeds. Alright, so what we're gonna do, guys, is we're gonna slide down and have some fun. We're gonna have a southern accent as we're freaking going down the freaking bottom. And now I got a surf right here, which actually leads to a south. There you go. Oh yeah. Oh, dang it. And I actually missed. That is smart. Alright, anyways, guys, let's actually try that again. Alright, and this time we actually go this way. This way, we're going this way. Come on, ah, dang it. Uh, okay, box. I want to, I want to do this. I want to get that sock really bad. <laughs> I want to get it, guys. Alright, come on, we can do it. We can do it. I popped, I popped. I'm jumping over down. Do it, do it. Let's go. And yes, all right, awesome. Okay, so now we have nine. We have one more until we get another golden spatula. And uh, here we go. It's there. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, yeah. Shit going down. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's do this. Let's do this. Gonna have some fun here. Just my side. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's do this. I'm gonna get freaking Patrick back. Don't worry about it. Patrick, y'all gonna be fine. Fine as ever can be. I'm gonna destroy you too. Destroy you. Alright, now the ultimate popcorn up to you, Mr. Duplicate of Tron 1000. I'll make sure you don't survive for too long. Can I hit you? And suck it. Alright. <laughs> Honestly, I shouldn't be saying things like suck it during a Switch Robots play, so I apologize. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's get some, let's get this last guy on here. And then we'll be on our way. Yeah, this game is this first level is pretty easy. It, get, it actually does get a little bit of difficulty later on, so you gotta just watch yourself. Hey SpongeBob! Woo! Thank goodness you're safe, Patrick. Well, of course, SpongeBob. Why wouldn't I be? Well, the robot and... Oh yeah, I found this for you. I don't know what it is, but it looks important. 
Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Okay. All right, so now we're playing as Patrick. Some new things that we have to know about. He can do body slam. He can do a like, stomach slam and things now. Uh, and uh, he can also throw things, which we'll see in a few minutes. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. All right, so now we have six spatulas. Six spatulas. All right, this is throw through. Throw through, throw through, throw through. <laughs> Patrick can pick up throw fruit and throw it. Throw fruit will push buttons, destroy tiki's, or damage robots. But use it quickly because throw fruit will wilts after a few seconds. Okay, cool. Uh, we are gonna throw it there. Yay! We did it. Patrick can also pick up and throw tiki's, but only tiki's that don't have other tiki stuck on top of them. I see how this works. Oh, dang it. This is a bus stop. You may switch between players but play SpongeBob or play Patrick at bus stops. I see. Ah, oh, damn it! Patrick can throw fruit up steps, then climb the steps, pick up the fruit, and then throw it again, but he'd be better heard before it wilts. Okay. And we did it. Awesome. Damn it! <laughs> Why do the sides keep on interrupting me picking up things? This is a special Patrick Teeter Totter that only Patrick can use. Have Patrick pick up the throw fruit, fruit, stand on the pink starfish side, and throw the fruit at the target side. Patrick will then be flung across the other side of the lake. There we go. There we go. And hey. Awesome. Okay. Ah, oh, dang it. I thought I fell. This is a thunder tiki. When Patrick touches it, it will begin to storm, and after a few seconds, it will go boom. It will be near when it goes boom. And there you go. Awesomeness. Alright. Patrick can pick a thunder tiki and throw it just like other tiki. He has to better, better throw it fast. Talking to me. Almighty Rock, I am at your command. Down here, you big pink lummox. Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday, and now my neck hurts. I, I'll say that's one of the best lines from this game, I, honestly. Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help <laughs> defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low-quality design and knock-off wallets. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you! Alright, anyways. Weirdest conversation yet. If you jump up in the air and press the zero. Yeah, we already know that. I'm not gonna bother to read all the signs. I already taught you guys. Alright, anyways, let's move on here. This is a uh, not a fun cave. Let's just say that. I don't like this cave. Down here. Okay, so remember, Patrick could throw a fruit, throw for it, then pick it up and throw it again before it wilts. Okay. Wait, 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 we're 
Okay, since we're right at the other guy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There you go. Ah. Ah, boom. Ow, freaking hell. I can't get that freaking out of the way. I'm thinking you guys understand. Um, but yeah, they they have multiple teleportation boxes for um, each area. Do not know that. Okay, this is a freezy fruit. Yes. So now we know what a freezy fruit is. So now we can actually just walk around here. We got this thing. And we got this thing. Alright, so now we have 10 socks with Patrick when we go back to Bikini Bottom. Oh god. Yeah, so when we go back to Bikini Bottom, if Patrick belly flops near robots, he can damage or stun them. S small robots will simply be de defeated by Patrick's belly flop. Larger robots will be stunned for a short period of time. Uh, but anyways. So the thing is- Oh wow, that was a lot. Um... So basically, um, yeah, we can actually get it from him to get the cold dispatch from him when we're playing him. Ah, oh, yes. That was good. Okay, this we're gonna have to stun the person. Got one, right? Dang it. All right. Anyways, there you go. Golden spatula, it's number seven. We're doing good. How many do we have so far at, in this area? Just trying to check. So, oh wow, we only have four. So we have four more to go. So we're actually halfway through. All right, guys. So we did jellyfish caves now, and uh, I think I'm gonna end it off here. So thank you guys so much for watching. This is the Mr. Wee Maniac here for uh, Let's Play a Battle for Bikini Bottom, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. And I have to pause it. Wait a minute. <laughs> this is bad. Wait, wait. All right, bye, guys. Bye. Ah. <laughs> uh.